Hi YouTube, Tim Unkert from UnkertEducation.com here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to run C and C++ files in the Pulsar text editor. Okay, so first we want to install Xterm. Okay, so to do that, I'm going to open up a terminal here. And let me expand this, make it a little bit larger so you can see what I'm doing. I'm going to type sudo apt install Xterm and hit enter. It's going to ask me to confirm the additional space. I'm going to press Y and enter. And once that's done, we can close this out. Okay. And now what I need to do is install a package in the Pulsar text editor. So I'm going to do control comma to bring up the packages. I'm going to click on install and I'm going to search for GPP. And the first thing that comes up is this gpp-compiler. I'm going to click install to install that. Okay. Once that's installed, I can close this out and let me create uh, a program in my main.c file. So I'm going to include a header file here. So I'll include the standard input output header file. Okay. And actually, we only need one hashtag there. And I'm going to create my main function. And you know, I just hit uh, tab to autocomplete that. So we've got some shortcuts there. And let's just do a simple uh, printf statement like, hi, my name is Tim. Okay. And let's save it. And now to run it, let's expand this. And we're going to right click on the file. And we're going to go down. And now we have this option to compile and run. So I'm going to click on that. And you'll see it pops up here in a terminal in Xterm. That's why we installed Xterm. Now the font is small. You can uh, you know, set up Xterm to your liking, so this is a lot larger. Um, but yeah, this is how I compile and run programs in the Pulsar text editor when I'm doing C and C++. It's a very handy plugin, especially when working with smaller scripts. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, could you please like and subscribe? Thank you.